Hey people of the interweb, I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome to the first of a series I'm doing called Subreddit Reaction. Yeah, it's probably nothing new on this... YouTube. <laughs> that That's descriptive. Um, but I... So I recently watched a video that Markiplier did... And based off that statement and the thumbnail and the title, you probably already can... Well, just by the thumbnail and title, you could probably already figure out what the hell I'm doing. <sighs> anyway. So, yeah, we are going to look at the subreddit Dog Free. A uh, dog hating subreddit. Or a dog... Uh, a subreddit dedicated to... Uh... The disliking of dogs. Note that this video is being made three days after Mark posted his. And within this time period... Well, you're about to see what I... Shut up, phone. You're about to see why I'm kind of making this video. Uh, so what I'll be doing is I'll be reacting... Uh, I'll be giving off just only fact and my own personal reasoning and opinions based off all all the facts that la are laid out. Uh, but I'm also going to react to some things that people have said towards Mark, uh, which seems... Some of these seem a bit unreasonable, and some of them are actually completely reasonable. They make a lot of sense to do. However, I'm trying to scroll down to the bottom one I saw. Good God, how many of these are there? <laughs> okay, I think this is the first one I found. All right, so I'm going to have the one, one of the ones that I found um, towards Mark. I don't know if this is the hate one or not, but probably not. I don't think it is. Okay, no, this isn't the first one I found. This is the second one. There are at least three that I found. Um, they're all scattered all over the place, though, so I'm not gonna, I'm gonna pick up on three of them, uh, that I can pinpoint like that, but other than that, I'm not going to really worry about trying to hunt them down, I'll just look through this subreddit other than that, unless I run out of time, which I might. <laughs> anyway, so this is the subreddit, thanks, Mark, says, Teriyaki Weeb. Nice name. It's gonna make me hungry, though, so... <laughs> Finally, subreddit that a subreddit that doesn't complain that I don't like dogs. It's not that I hate dogs, but I have gotten bit by a dog when I was like 12 and I got rabies. Never heard that happen before. I've heard people get bit by dogs, but rabies after that? And I've read, I've read this before, but now that I'm thinking about it, I've never heard of this situation before. Okay, sure. Um, the rabies vaccine? I mean, even other people are questioning it. Anyway, so there was one that was a bit lower than that that had to do with Mark. Huh! This one wasn't it, but I just saw Markiplier's name on this. Firstly, I love a good dog. A good dog. One who's well-trained, well-behaved, and quiet. Quiet. I think, well, that's like 20% of dogs, so that's not really a fair thing. Because a lot of them are little, they're child, or they're just poorly trained. So one of those things is bound to be a fault in most dogs. But there are the occasional dog where it's you've got the perfect dog and it's like well trained, old enough to realize, hey, I need to be quiet, and then other things like that. And some of them are even old and they're still loud. In that case, they're just, that's in that 20%. It's in the 80%. That's in like the 20 of 80%, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, they are not the lords of your house. They are not cute in every little thing that they do. Yeah, that's true. 
I can understand people being annoyed by others uh, thinking that dogs are cute in every single thing. That That is kind of irritating. I'm not going to deny that. Came here for Markiplier's video only two minutes in. Wow. Only two minutes in. Since it seemed like a fun mind mindset. You are smart. You are smart. You saw that there was one there. You left the video and came here. That's a smart thing to do. And as you can partially see it, but right here I have Mark's uh, video up. Because there is one thing I'm going to say uh, in a little bit towards... Uh, <clears throat> towards a particular comment I found in this, and I have it paused at that particular point. Um, but in the meantime, I'm not going to worry about it. I might not be full on get rid of them all, but pet owners definitely need to take more responsibility for such animals. This is exactly what Mark said in his video. Bad owners, not bad pets. Either that or bad trainers. Kind of depends. That Mark didn't say. The bad trainers thing, I mean, if you train the dog poorly, it's going to act bad. Just saying. TLDR. I know, I skipped a little bit of it. That was intentional, because this is a long one. If you guys are curious and you want to know what it says, just head to uh, Dog Free. Uh, remember though, it's got a lot of dog hate, and if it has any dog love in it, that's going to be depleted, so don't hate the haters, okay? If you want to do that, do it via video, I guess. <laughs> like me. <laughs> Except I'm not going to hate the haters, I'm just going to go based off fact, contradict some things, and then agree with some things. Kind of depending on the facts. TLDR. Don't hate dogs per se, but I abhor the, laz the lazy owners. Same, dude. Same. <laughs> and they're enabling ways. Markiplier sent me, and I'll be sure to post some stories about my dog walking days soon. Okay, so you like dogs, you just don't like the owners. That is reasonable. And I mean, even if they said they don't like the trainers who train them poorly, that also is technically reasonable, because the dog's actions, if they've never been trained and they're first owned, well, they're going to act stupid, duh. They're going to act like, well, animals. Because, I don't know, they're animals. What the fuck? All right, there are a lot of Markiplier things that I didn't realize seeing before. This here, the meme. Shit post. Well, at least you're admitting it's a shit post. <laughs> From Feral Ray Chill. Raise your hand if you've ever been personally victimized by Markiplier's video on Dog Free. There's a... Okay, well, I mean... Hey, the girl in the purple jacket, she's technically just raising her jacket's arm. Who knows? Her, ha her hands could just be like... She could just be like... Okay, I can't do it. Never mind. <laughs> hey! The teacher's not. The teacher isn't. <laughs> the teacher's important, right? <laughs> I think. But seriously, stop hating the person who's just giving his own opinion. That's literally all he's doing. Alright, let's see here. Meme. One of the most annoying dog equal good phrases deserves a meme. You know what? As often as it happens, I can accept this. Person? Dogs are so loyal. That person's dog when they open the front door. She's <laughs> dashed! <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, there are... I think Mark actually looked at this one, too. I think this is kind of as far as Mark went right here. Um, maybe. I don't know. But I think he reacted to this one. But there is a comment he said, he, I remember him saying, where it was just like, like, because, no, it was a different image. It was an image of a guy on the right-hand side being dragged, like, 
yanked by a giant dog. This makes me think of his comment where it's just like you have to pretty much just be like right next to them all the time. They're very energetic animals. You can't deny that. Sometimes it's a good thing. Sometimes it's a bad thing. Now, in this case, it's... I can see where they're trying to get at. It's just, like, too energetic. Like, they're always rambling all over the place. That's not... Well, like, 80% of the time, that's not a good thing. So, I can understand this. My roommate wants to get a dog. Just by that title alone, you don't want me to be your roommate. Because I do, too. Honestly. Although, for personally for me, it's probably going to be... I'm going to try to make it one of those dogs that's not always loud. If it is, then I'm going to try to silence it. I don't know. I live in a state where a lot of people love dogs. It's You'll very rarely find someone in the, the place where I live uh, where someone doesn't like dogs. So... Ah! Ah! Yep, I haven't passed it yet. I think this is it, at least. This is another one about Mark. Thanks. Mark led me to this sub, and I love it. It's great that there are... <sighs> I'm sorry, I read there. It's T-H-E-I-R here. It's supposed to be T-H-E-R-E. -E. I'm sorry for the correction, but I... I write all the time. And it, and it it's a pet peeve of mine to see something that you can correct before posting, and you don't correct it. I'll just try to skip over it, or skip over the idea. Um, it's great that there are people who have the same opinion as me. Thank you for this sub. That's positive. That is good. I love it when people aren't hating. Like, this person isn't hating on Mark. This isn't what I saw. I don't know if I actually saw this one. I, there are a couple I've skipped over. This one and the last one... I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to belch. Jeez, I'm sorry. People like, uh, let's see. Reddit guy 01234. Okay. Uh, people, people like Reddit guy 01234 who aren't hating on Mark Like the meme from above, I can already see. Look, you can see that. You see that small thing down there, Markiplier shitstorm. That's hate. That's not good. Actually, you know what? I mean, I wouldn't. He's not hating. He's giving his own opinion. And, I mean, yeah, I've seen the video multiple times. It can go extensive sometimes. Sometimes he doesn't have something to back himself up. But don't hate on the hater. You're haters yourselves. So why why hate the hater who... Well, that doesn't even make sense. I was going to say don't hate the hater who hates the haters. But he doesn't hate the haters. He just hates the comments. Sometimes. It just... It's a pet peeve. Everyone has one. And that's a poor way of putting it, too. I'm not saying Mark's a hater. In fact, I'm pretty damn sure he's not. <laughs> Put it this way. He has specific things that just... I mean, he said this in his video. He has specific things that just get... He, he can't stand. He's not hating on you guys. He just... It's not something he can stand seeing. A difference although this is hating mark he's not hating you guys he's hating the comments there's a big difference it's just basically saying be careful what you say that's really it all right this is the one that got to me mark's video is complete bullshit i don't know if it's just me or that i only watched the first few minutes of the video But I couldn't stand it. He's like, don't go to this subreddit. When it's completely obvious that he hates the community and us included. 
He hates the comments. Watch the whole video, you nincompoop. The fact that he didn't look at a lot of the stories, you wouldn't know that because he didn't watch the whole video. He didn't look at it because he wanted to make a video off of it blind, you idiot. Sorry, but if you're not going to go into the actual... If you don't have evidence, then you're, you shouldn't be making this kind of comment. He doesn't hate the community. Watch the whole video. You'll realize that he doesn't hate the community. He hates the comments. The extensive comments, I should say. Because partway through the video, he states that, Hey, this is okay. I understand this. You have reason for this. But this is not. This is crossing the line. You don't have reason, and you're just hating. That doesn't make sense. So watch the whole video. If you're not going to watch the whole video, then don't watch any of the video. Be smart like the person from before. Watch a little... I think it was the person from before. I don't know. I don't know. In my mind, it's... If you're not going to watch the whole video, just watch as much as, hey... I mean, literally, the thumbnail, the thumbnail says, says, this subreddit hates dogs. If he says don't watch it, you take this into consideration. He owns a dog. He loves his dog. No, he owns two dogs. He loves them both. What do you think he's going to say? Take that into consideration. Also, when he looks at the we don't deserve dogs tweet, he's just like, it's all worth it because of the I. What are you doing here, sir? Ma'am? I'm sorry, I don't know whether you're a guy or a girl. He's had good experiences with dogs. He's on the opposite end of the spectrum than you guys are, okay? Don't judge him for be having good experiences with dogs and seeing haters and not being used to it. Now that's pretty much where I clicked off the video to one. Where did he say that? Like, I'm right here right now. This is... 3 minutes and 51 seconds in. He's about to say something I still haven't come across. I don't know why. Play Smash Bros. on my Switch. Okay. I clicked off the video to 1. Play Smash Bros. on my Switch. And 2. I couldn't stand it. Wow. Not much patience do you have. I am Yoda. Or, sorry. Yoda I am. Shut up. <laughs> Look. Don't hate the guy for just making his own opinion, okay? All he's saying is that he, he's basing it off of his own personal experience. So are these guys. So don't just go hating on him because he loves his dog. That's literally all he's doing. He put some love and time and effort into caring for his dog, and the same happens back. Why do you think that we're categorized scientifically as animals? It's because it works the same way. If you don't give love to kids, you just care for them. And I mean the phrase care for, not actually you give care to them. You care about them. No, I just mean care for them as in you feed them. You give them clothes. You put them up. You give them under a roof. That's it. Kind of. I mean... If you do that with a dog, the dog's going to hate you. The dog's not going to listen to you. That's why this happens more often than not. It's because people care for them, but they don't love them. If I'm wrong, prove it to me. I want evidence. But from what I've seen, it's true. Also, to all mods out there, keep going. I don't know what you have to deal with, partly because you guys are 10 out of 10 at your jobs. We are, we at Dog Free support you. That I can understand. And you know what? If you're still watching this, just go watch the rest of the video. I urge you. That way you can see what he's trying to say. Why he, he, that, that was a poor place to stop. Just put it that way. Anyway minutes okay so this one's just gonna be towards mark haters of mark on dog free let's see there are a couple uh, I've seen 
and it might have been shown on here, I don't know, um, where it's just like, they don't hate him. Wow. You know what? I agree with this guy. I didn't see this one before. So it's... The mods in Mark's subreddit are pretty cool about this whole thing. That's because Mark's community generally are positive. You got some negative people, obviously, but generally they're all positive, including myself. And I'm sorry if I sound negative in this, but I'm just... Facts are negative sometimes. There's nothing you can do about it. The mods in Mark's subreddit are pretty cool about this. Let's see. I think this posted by Lord saying that so oh gosh. I've seen his posts. Anyone found posting harassment in dog free will be immediately perm banned, permanently banned. Yeah, they should be. If you're going to post harassment on that, that's not cool, man. If you're gonna post hate, that is not cool. This is why people are hating on Mark should be banned from this one. I'm sorry, but if you're going to hate on somebody for something else, you shouldn't be posting about it. Keep it in here. Now, I'm not trying to hate the haters, but the haters are hating somebody giving off their personal opinion. And I mean, they've said they hate. They literally use the word hate in this, so you can't say it's not a hater. Jeez, Mouse, come on, cooperate. All right, one more thing. Let's see if I can find it. I haven't found the one that gave, made me want to get this in the first place. Do, do this video. I can't word. I can't find the one that made me want to do this video in the first place. Wait, this is two days ago, so this is still... This sub has made me dislike pit bulls. Wow. There are way too... Let's see if I can see it. I don't hate dogs. I hate close-minded dog owners. That one makes sense. Like that. That makes a lot of sense. Unfortunately, that's a lot of people. <laughs> and then there's a link to this. To this. Markiplier sent me, I think you should know, you know, there's a reason he posts it on YouTube and not on Reddit. Huh. So this was around the time where Mark Stubb posted it. I guess I came across it already. Maybe I missed it. I don't know. Yeah, of course I missed something. Thank you, Mark. Came from Markiplier's video. Subscribed instantly. Don't much care for dogs myself either. More of a cat person. Good luck with the shitstorm mods. Good luck with the Mitch shitstorm mods. Hopefully it dies down soon. Alright, so... It kind of seems like this person cares for Mark but still likes the mods, which I guess is fine. All right, it seems like with every... So here's what, here's what I'm going to uh, finalize on this since I can't seem to find what I was originally looking for. So I found a comment... All right, now I'm randomly finding stuff. And it was actually involving pit bulls. So the one I'm looking at, Mark Plyer and fans should read this before continuing on. Credit goes to an anonymous poster for the following. Wow. If you're not willing to say at least some kind of link or something, then how do we know you're not lying? 
Just saying. I'm not saying you are lying, but I mean, if you don't have a source for the evidence, then it's not true evidence. Just saying. Pitbulls were responsible for 74% of dog bite fatal fatalities in 2017, despite only making up about 6.5% of the U.S. dog population. Okay. That one actually is true. Although, here's the thing. Before I continue on, what I found earlier was just that somebody hated Mark because they assumed, based off his statement at the beginning, which I actually have rung up, um, for saying that he hates pit bulls. He, he is, he just, but what he was saying was actually, oh, that was a weird place to pause it, this. I, I glanced over it and I kind of got the impression that this subreddit doesn't like pit bulls. Anywhere in that does he say, I hate pit bulls, or I hate the fact that they hate pit bulls directly. It's just they hate pit bulls. No. He says, I have the impression that they don't like them, that they hate pit bulls. I am getting, based off of what they're saying, it feels like they hate pit bulls. Not they hate pit bulls. Direct accusation. He never did that. This is like the 15th time I've played through this video, by the way. I oh, Okay, that's over-exaggerating by a lot. But anyway, <sighs> I am going to leave this video here. Point of this video is just don't, don't hate on somebody for going through a subreddit and giving their own personal opinion on it without actually hating on anybody. Because that never happened even though people are claiming it did. And I've just given you evidence on one sense of it, which seemed to be most of it, by the way. A lot of people seem to be ac accusing him of hating. Uh, 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 he seems to be accused of accusing them of hating, just outright hating pit bulls, just generally. And nobody likes them on this. He never said that. He said, and if it's not that, it's also the fact that people just think he's hating these people in general. He definitely never said that. He never would. And, I mean, again, I've seen the video multiple times to know this. Anyway, again, I'm going to leave this video here with the message of just please don't hate on somebody if they're just going to give their own personal opinion on something. It's not right. It's not morally right. But in the meantime, uh, if you want to see any of the other videos that I've done in the past, just click the video, uh, the link in the bottom right hand corner over there. Um, and if you're interested in any of the future subreddit things that I'll be doing, which won't be regarding hate, by the way, this is the only one that will, uh, subscribe to the channel. Link should just be down there somewhere. Depends on where you're looking. <laughs> but in the meantime, I'm out and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.